What about campaign collusion? The left says, just spent two years obsessing over a lie and a hoax. We now have four separate investigations. One, the FBI, nine months. Two, the Intel community in the ha Committee in the House. Three, a bipartisan Senate committee. And now the Mueller report. No evidence of collusion. Yet, is anybody in the mainstream media, do they ever care about truth, real evidence? There is real evidence of collusion. Well, one, we have the phony Clinton bought and paid for Russian dossier. That was used to influence the election. But we also know there's a brand new article out by investigative reporter John Solomon. Ukrainian to U.S. prosecutors. Why don't you want the evidence on Democrats? Well, that would actually be Hillary. John Solomon details the real evidence of collusion between the government of Ukraine and top Democrats to help Hillary in the 2016 election. Here with more, John Solomon, investigative reporter. I'll let you bring everyone up to speed. There is evidence here, just like there was, ev we know Hillary paid for the phony Russian dossier to influence that part of the election as well. Yeah, that's right, Sean. Ukrainian authorities are telling me since last year, they've been trying to get this evidence to the Trump Justice Department, and they've been thwarted by the U.S., First at the embassy in Kiev, where they wouldn't give them uh, uh, visas to come to the United States to deliver the evidence in person. Then they hired a former U.S. attorney from the Bush years and asked him to bring it to the Southern District of New York. Never heard back after they made the offer of the evidence. More recently, they're looking at, for American lawyers to come in and possibly file a lawsuit to recover some of the monies they believe were stolen in corrupt Democratic schemes. Now, what is the evidence they're talking about? It's pretty remarkable. They have two affidavits from Ukrainian Law enforcement officials saying, yes, we did try to tip the 2016 election in favor of Hillary Clinton. They have a tape recording of the head of NABU, their uh, FBI of Ukraine, their anti-corruption police, acknowledging that he tried to help Hillary Clinton by leaking uh, the Paul Manafort documents. They have evidence of contacts between the Democratic National Committee, Hillary Clinton's campaign, and Ukrainian officials here in Washington transferring or transmitting evidence related to Donald Trump and alleged ties to Russia. That's just some of the stuff, not even uh, talking about the things that we talked last week with Joe Biden and the, and the $3 million his son made while Joe Biden was vice president uh, and the effort that Joe Biden did to thwart an investigation of his son's company in Ukraine. So a lot of evidence, and it doesn't seem to find a receptive audience right now in Washington. All right, John Solomon, investigative reporter. We're going to continue on that story. And... Uncle Joe, crazy Uncle Joe Biden, yeah, he's got, and creepy Uncle Joe, he's got a lot to get to.